STEM designation means a lot to me. As an educator, I believe that teaching students to think critically and work together and problem solve are the most valuable lessons that I can teach them. So STEM designation has given me the opportunity to refine my practice and grow professionally so that I can provide more impactful learning opportunities for my students. We have a community of teachers that look forward to coming to school. They're just as excited as the students are um, because they know that the work that they do is meaningful, it's going to be fun, it's going to impact them for years to come. They love what they do. It is a wonderful process when we see our teachers' eyes light up uh, in STEM classrooms. Our teachers are allowing our students to have those experiences. Our teachers are now a part of the learning process. They're learning alongside our stakeholders. They're learning alongside our students. So our teachers are enriched. Sometimes we think STEM is only your science, technology, engineering, and math, but it isn't. It, it's a problem-solving process that can be applied in every single subject, and even things that you do outside of school, things that are gonna help you outside of your K-12 education. Our STEM lab allows students that might not be as successful in the classroom, it allows them to be successful someplace else. We've seen students that you know, have really struggled academically. They have just excelled in the e-lab. They've been able to do things that other students couldn't do. They became leaders where they traditionally weren't leaders. They're not scared to try something new. They're not scared to fail because mistakes are just proof of learning. Kids are excited and they want to learn when it comes to STEM, especially whenever you approach things like in a problem or a project-based kind of application where like they're having to explore the things that you want them to explore to answer the question. Problem and project-based learning is collaborative. You cannot solve problems in isolation. The world that our kids are going into, there's not a place that I can imagine where kids are gonna be working in isolation. I tell parents and students as uh, they come into our middle and our high school programs all the time that once you're in here, you're never alone. We're better together. I think that regionally and across the state through TSIN, we can share best practices that can just ultimately benefit our students. I had an amazing teacher that actually asked me step by step, what are you interested in? And they would ask me like, are you interested in math, reading? If you're not reading, do something else. STEM provides the fundamentals of learning and building up on your learning, not just learning the basics. TN STEM is a mindset. And as we progress through this program, we constantly realize how much more there is to this program because as we continue, we see all of the new topics and all of the new careers that this can take us through. Every kid should probably be in a STEM school because it's so much fun. You get to work with people and you get to collaborate. <laughs> I love my teachers. I think that teachers should adopt the STEM process because it not only makes learning fun for the students, but it also makes it really fun for the teachers too. When I can provide that highly engaging opportunity for students to discover and they can have those aha moments in the classroom, that is the food for the soul as a teacher and you get that from STEM. Teaching is hard, but it's not so hard when you're having fun. So about five years ago, I had stopped having fun. I've been teaching for 16 years, and I just, it wasn't fun anymore. And then when I got into STEM, all at once I was excited to come to work again. And honestly, if we're gonna retain teachers, they need to love their job. This is not a job that ends at three o'clock. It's a job that you do all summer, you do it all weekend, you do it at night, but I love what I'm doing, so I don't mind. STEM is often viewed as if we have time for it, or that's one more thing, and we can't possibly do one more thing at our school. And I would say it isn't one more thing. It's the things you're already doing, but with intentionality and purpose behind it so we can connect the learning within the building into the community, but then also elevate the learning experience students have. Everyone fits into STEM. STEM is for every teacher. It's for every student. It's for everyone.